Oh my god, this is loud. Yeah, it kind of is. Like, like, don't get me wrong. I like the sound of my own voice, but not this loud inside a headset. I like the sound of your voice, um, but I need it to be louder. Because oh. I, I like hearing you. I just, the music, I'm like, oh, oh smash music. Well, yes. anyways, so uh, here we got OGs, Carlos, and Sync on the mic. But here we have What's even good? more older Gs with Ultimate Razor and the, uh, oh, Elegant's only like 19 or something like that. <laughs> we're just, even though he's, uh, you know, really good in Smash, we're going to say he's new gen, just because <laughs> of his age. Sorry, Chief. Sorry, <laughs> Sorry Chief. And Razor, though, is actually like 50 years old, playing since the days of Brawl. Oh, yeah, that Ra man. Razor's been playing Snake. Oh, my God. He's been playing Snake for over 10 years, and you could tell wow, how he gets that forward air out of the grenade that looked like it was second instinct. Bro, this man, he's become one with the Snake. He doesn't even play the game, he just shows up and like, all right, y'all, time for this free money. Because you know what, man? <laughs> I get that. He's good. And, oh, Ooh. all right, besides that. Never but mind. Know, but that's Smash Ultimate. Uh, blame the buffer system. All right. Easy. All right, easy, all right. John. But it's okay. See, because Matt was born, all right, Elegant, sorry, was born in the buffer system, he's immune to it, all right? <laughs> but being the old gen that he is, Razor is a push vulnerable. All right, that was a good call out. Just rando spot dodge, but it wasn't random because he knew. You know what, bro? I know, I know you. You're Luigi. You're, you you want that grab? I saw I saw a Twitter thread today, and it was talking about how you can kind of just uh, spot dodge up tilt with grenade on the ground, and it's just such a good setup. It's Ooh. very safe. Directional air dodge again. Hello. But oh, it's okay. He living this time. He, we, he knew. We Gucci. He's not scared. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Didn't kill. Bulky back air, but not quite taking it. It's gonna be interesting to see. A lot of people like, you know, to trash Elegant because, bro, if he's just hitting you once, he's just grabbing you and he's getting the kills. Let me tell you, if it was that easy, we'd have 10 Luigi's on this PR. Because Luigi's not an uncommon character. He's not obscure. He's got a lot of fans, right? It's not that easy. Uh, buffer system, there's just blame the buffer system, all right? Yeah, that's Razor that's loses one stock, Elegant loses one stock. We all good, okay. We're one for one. That down B, oh my god, Snake is a big boy oh, living man. through that. His first game is kind of fraudulent, but it's okay. It's just a warm-up match. It is winner semis. <laughs> they, they don't even need this game, and they know it. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, I forgot about that. I did not see that there. I think most people got hit there. 103% yeah. for Elegant, and Snake's got Rage, so I'm pretty sure up to Ooh. kill, but never mind. Uh, now he's dead. No Rage, but he's going to go right under the C4. Oh, wait. Where did the C4 go? Oh, oh. there it is. There oh. it is. It's on the <laughs> Pokeball. It's on the red part. That's crazy. I, I'm here watching the match. I, have, I can dedicate my eyes just to Snake, and I still lose track of C4. That's insane. <laughs> anyway. Damn. Anyways, right? So it's going to be interesting to see. Um, a lot of people know what Luigi wants. That was pretty cool, actually, just doing a uh, affair to call it the spot dodge. Mm. Oh. Mm. One mistake. Hey, that's all it takes. But, you know, that was an interesting option because... Bye, Keith. Later. So that's an interesting option. So he realized, okay, you know what? Razor knows I'm going to grab. Okay? So Razor's going to spot dodge this fair. It's fast. It's active. I could do another move pretty quick. So it covers a lot of options. Mm -hmm, right yeah. there, unfortunately, the timing was off. I didn't honestly get a good, good look at it. But the spot dodge did lead into the up tilt. But it's interesting to see because a lot of Luigi's, after the opponent start adapting, they won't counter adapt. They'll just keep going for the grab and keep getting punished. Mm -hmm. like, it, because it's such a centralized part of your toolkit, knowing to work around people working around you is very important to get success. Yes. Like, if... If Elegant didn't adapt, he wouldn't be where he is today, all right? Oh, but, you know. most, most definitely. We can probably see him adjust. Looking for the spot dodges a little bit more. Oh, and great uh, forward smash. Really chop him off that grab. Rays are already sitting at 97%. I almost want to say that up that F smash looked like an accident, but you know what, bro? It worked. It hit. So he could say it's intentional. Thank, oh, things were done. Bro, first stock's already gone. The, uh, Elegant's doing pretty good right now. And you know, that's good because Razor himself is extremely good. So it's going to be interesting to see this adaptation just because he's down a whole stock. Where, oh, oh my goodness. Okay, that, that, that was a dicey situation. Yeah. Hello. Ooh, yeah. Nikita, really good usage of it. Wow. What, what, Hello? I'm actually very surprised Nikita did not hit it. We're just going to say that was a nerf to the Nikita hitbox, making it harder <laughs> to hit. Uh, oh, okay. Classic. Looking a little frustrated there. I'm actually surprised I connected, but it's okay. I like it still has the lead. Oh. Wow. Was, uh, okay. You trying to finish that one off with Zare? Oh, it was very interesting, actually. Very creative. But Razor just holding away the whole time. Okay. Great patience on that landing, getting that forward smash. Just chop that boy. 
that F smash definitely looks intentional. So congratulations. The plan, the plan <laughs> worked like, out. We can, we can confirm that one was intentional. Yeah, not all of them, but you know what? When it's intentional and it was a good idea, it's a good idea, man. When you're right, you're right. When I when I what I'm noticing from Elegant is he's kind of circumventing, uh, kind of doing an aerial approach, and he's kind of buffering his rolls in. So he'll land in front of him and buffer roll behind Snake. It's kind of been working. He's in the lead. I kind of like what he was doing there. He was doing like fair landing, fair landing, right? Like not really approaching. He be reversed. That was really, wow. really smart, actually. So he's like, "You, bro, I have the lead. I'm just not gonna approach." Oh, J.K. Here's a dash attack. It didn't work out, but I think it's the right idea. Is mixing in like, oh, th is that true? That looks I'm, pretty true. Uh, yeah, I, th I think that was. Okay, you know what? That's pretty wild, but it's good that your character, when your character has some very clean way of just killing Snake, easy, two minute guaranteed. Match. T two minute match, bro. It's all right. Next min, next match also gonna be two minutes. As you know, people are like Snake is like best character in the game right now, right? That's the uh, consensus for this month. Every okay, month it's a okay. new character, but yeah. this month is Snake. My 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 Twitter senses agree. Right, right. We we know we know what people are saying, and people nobody's putting Luigi in top ten right now, right? Well, let me tell you something. When you're playing against the Snake, right? It's very important for your character to have tools to deal with Snake very well. Because mm -hmm. not all characters have it, right? But it looks like Luigi has the uh, privilege of just doing, you know, down throw up B. Bro, that's great. You need, you need to use every tool you have against Snake. And if, Because if you don't, you're asking to lose. Anyways, here we are. Third game. Going to Kalos. This is interesting. I don't know. Unova, Unova. This is Bro, Razor's favorite counter pick because it's dark and he can be fraudulent with down B. Bro, I forgot the stage exists. Nobody takes me to it, but... Yeah, man. He's trying to make sure you don't see any of his explosives. Uh, okay. He's, he's wild like that. Interesting. I, I wonder if Elegant knew that beforehand because he do, you do get three bans. So, anyways, going to... Let's see. What? All right. You know, it's pretty even. I was honestly expecting a more explosive match right now. So we're going to see how they're going to find the kill. Okay, Razor, going for the fair. It's trying like, to find the fair in between the oh. fireballs. And Nikita just covered all those options right there. Just directional air dodge, and it's going to just hit. A lot of people wonder, bro, why don't you just hit the Nikita? Some people are like, isn't Cyclone invincible? Can't you Cyclone Nikita? But no, that's not going to work. You can just Z-drop Nikita and make it active again, even if you're hitting it. Yep, true. So, you know, it's something you're just forced to air dodge and hope for the best. And did you, it work? You are not safe when you hit the Nikita, by the way. Yeah, the, the, it works against Razors who don't, sorry, against Snakes who don't same, know what they're doing. Same word. Yeah, whatever. When you, I mean, hey, we got a Void, and Void's pretty good uh, Snake as well, so True. I know Razor's not the only Snake in the world, believe it or not. <laughs> but anyways, so right now it's not looking too great for Elegant because, you know, he's uh, a one up tilt away from dying. Honestly, anything kills right now, let's go up tilt. Yes. Right. That forward smash not quite being fast enough to stop that up tilt. And I really liked how he slowed it down with fireballs. It just, it's so laggy when you throw them out, you know, and Razor's quick to punish it. Ooh. Wow, he just, honestly, that grab frame, it like, takes me by surprise every time I see it. Just when he does an option and the grab comes out so fast, I think he can do another option. Oh, wow, I actually thought that the Nikita was going to hit him again, but he was able to up you right through it, so that's pretty great. All right, you know what? Let's be real here. It's Let's just say it's even, all right? Because Luigi, <laughs> let's, let's just, just say, say it's even, because the second Luigi takes his stock, all right, he's gonna get, he's gonna get a zero to death. It's ready, I'm ready for the Twitter combo. Oh, wow, what a response to the sticky. Wow, great. <gasps> okay. Wow, all right, he's in it. That's it, That's that was the Look play. at the patience. I, I know Razor's looking for an opening in between these fireballs. He's going to, like, explode and dash attack. Oh, my God. He went for the Ooh. grab. He wants it. You're he talking it. about the Luigi combo. He knows. Oh, is Razor letting himself get hit? <gasps> That'd be really funny, actually, if Razor's letting himself get hit in order to get outside of the Luigi Zero the I've, Death window. I, I've talked to him about stuff like that before. He is capable of making that decision, at least. Yes, and Snake is a character that can damage himself if he wants to. Yeah, right? true. Very, very few characters have that privilege, and they just have to... Hope, just hope that Luigi's gonna hit. Oh, wow! That man just did it. He just rolled behind him and uh, and up tilted. He knew what he was fishing for the whole time. That's why the fireballs were coming. They were trying to condition the shield so he can get the grab. He's like, when he runs up to me, I know he's gonna try and grab me. Yeah. Good awareness. I, 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 at least that's what I think he was thinking. Yeah. No. Honestly, I think so too. And that time, instead of spot dodging, right? He's like, bro, how about I just roll behind you? Your grab attempt. Yeah. And if I know the timing's uh, a little hard to get because. Obviously, Luigi's grab has 
very good frame mm -hmm. data. So if you start your roll a little too late, Luigi's like, um, how about I just grab you anyways? Yeah. But uh, let me just let me just throw out move neutral air, even if you get too close. Oh like. uh, yeah, but no, right there, timing was great. So he just rolled. A lot of players would say it was a rando rando roll, right? <laughs> and maybe. But the thing is, he just won, so you can claim that it was calculated. And it lay. All right, it looks reasonably <laughs> true, calculated. True, true. I can no, I can really see that though, because it. When you watch the match, they you could see the players adapting. Like I promise you, I saw maybe like two fireballs game one uh, out, yeah. of, out of elegant. Um, Razor spot dodged less um, as elegant was catching on to his spot dodges. We saw a little bit of evolution. Right, they, they're definitely adap adapting. I don't want to make it sound like oh, bro, Razor just got lucky. Like I love trash talking Razor because you know I love trash talking players to get better results than me. But you know <laughs> he played pretty well, right? It's obviously we don't we never want to say. Snake played well, right? Because we want to discount them as much as we yeah, can. Yeah, but, definitely. All right, bro. You, you did it. That, that was good. See, we're, we're honest here at Playing With Fire, okay? We try to, yeah, we try to be humble. We, we, yeah, we're just You talking. said, let's just keep it real. Let's keep it real. <laughs> Both of those were very good players. A lot of people are already familiar with Elegant, probably. But if you're a Smash 4 player, you might not have been feeling a Razor. Don't get it fooled. Um, I honestly, I didn't know because I played Smash 4, I didn't play Brawl, so I was like, who's Razor? And mm. like, people around here gave me death glares, like, you don't know who Razor is, bro? Oh my god. I'll have you know. Who's Razor giving was... you death glares? That's rude. 